topic. Uh, but speaking of Fifty, so Fifty just uh landed a deal with um Netflix to do the the you know the Diddy Did It or whatever he's gonna call <laughs> it the, the documentary. He said oh, there was a bidding shit. war, but he went with Netflix, I guess, you know, because they got the bigger bag. Yeah, yeah, Netflix, Netflix then turned up on motherfuckers, yeah. bro. Netflix then turned up on motherfuckers for real. They didn't got the Jake Paul, the uh, Mike Tyson fight. That's crazy. They getting whatever they want, nigga. The Netflix having their way right now. <laughs> but, no, nah, that shit crazy. So, he doing the Diddy. Doing it, yeah. The Diddy Diddy. He going to expose it all. And Ooh, then, today, he just posted, shit. like, he said, um... I'm going to stop talking about Diddy. He said, he said Diddy, because uh, I guess there was a new lawsuit, which we'll talk about next. But he said, um, he going to stop talking about it. He said, Diddy might kill himself. He was like, dang, another one? Meaning the lawsuit. He said, I'm gonna, this is going to be my last post about Diddy. Because Diddy yeah. might kill himself. Yeah, that nigga. Nah, he ain't going to kill himself. He ain't going to kill himself, but he know he know he didn't, he know he didn't tarnish his name, though. Yeah. It's over with, bro. Like... Diddy, we'll never look at you the same, bro. It's, it's over with. So it's, it's, it ain't even no point of killing yourself, nigga. You still up a billion dollars, nigga. We don't matter. Shit, we just regular people. We don't matter. It's not like you knew us anyway. Uh, uh, but I'm pretty sure for your circle and shit. But I'm, I'm saying, though, the people that you was fucking with was already condoning it and doing the shit that you doing. So the people that really matter to you is cool with it, bro. So you don't, you know, ain't no need to kill yourself or nothing like that. You feel me? It's it just everybody else not fucking with you now. But like I said, you already up damn near a, b a bill. So, nigga, it just go right off in the sunset. Go chill out, man. Stop throwing parties where you got to collect niggas' phones and shit. And this type of shit wouldn't be happening, bro. I've never had a party where a nigga come through. I'm give me your phone. That's yeah, crazy. some unseen shit finna be going. Nah, bro, we finna have a real party. Y'all not having a real party. That's what they call it, a ditty party. Yeah, yeah, facts. But he gonna, because I think... More and more people going to come out because you can only imagine the people he done did dirty. Come. So he going to have to spend a lot of money, you know what I'm saying? That's so, how it go all the time. As soon as one of them come out, everybody else get that courage too. Yep. Like, oh, he just did, oh, this nigga did the same shit. I me. need a bag. Everybody get that courage. Because at first, motherfuckers think people ain't going to believe him, bro. Mm -hmm. As soon as they see somebody believe that shit, floodgates finna open, bro. Everybody finna come run through that bitch. Facts. And they, they said... um. About that video, because Diddy had paid, I guess, the, whoever, 50K for that, you know, that video. So, he thought that it was going to never come out. That it out. was just gone. That but, it was banned. It's not. They sold you a copy of that yeah. shit, nigga. <laughs> they sold you a copy of that shit. They kept a copy, it. nigga. Cassie had a copy already. Because Ca I ain't going to lie. Cassie probably paid 50 bands for a copy, too. Mm. 50, 100 bands for a copy, too. Nigga. Yeah, bro. That nigga put, put his feet all in her ass, bro. Whoever that was who had the tapes came up, boy. Oh, yeah. Uh, easy it's play. The same, it's the same. You know what else is the same? It's the same way for whoever had that, whoever sold that tape of of uh, uh, Draymond Green punching Jordan Poole to TMZ. Oh, yeah, uh, yeah. Whoever sold that tape to that, bro, them niggas got paid for that shit. Them niggas up. Them niggas up, bro. They saying Jay-Z next, but, I mean, I don't, I, I don't, I don't think. I believe it. I don't know. I just don't. But we thought, you know, we didn't, we didn't see it in Diddy. You know what I'm saying? So who knows? Yeah, what? That's what I'm saying. I believe it. It's but he's been with Beyonce for so long. You know what I'm saying? That Beyonce, Beyonce part of it. No, she ain't no do different. Don't be like that. Come on now. Man, Beyonce, that would be crazy if something came bro, out like that. You don't. I you don't obtain. I'm seeing that now, bro. With my own eyes, bro. You don't obtain that type of money, that type of level of success without doing some shit you're not supposed to be doing, bro. Crazy. Nigga, you didn't did some shit that you was not supposed to do. That you wouldn't have done if you was a regular nigga still back on the block, bro. Yep. Cause you knew you had to be in jail. When you get that money, you know, you, you know, know what I'm saying? saying? So that's that's what be fucking me up about these niggas, bro. It it, it be like you just you weren't good with the money you was making and shit, but I mean when you when you start living them type of lifestyles, bro, you always need more money, bro. Yeah. As soon as that money stop coming in, your life finna crumble super fast. So these it's like these niggas doing damn near doing whatever they want to do for the bread, bro. Hey man, it's your boy Big Game. You tapping in the Pop Austin Media. You like that content, man? Hit that like subscribe button and get in tune for sure for sure.